Okay, so we just got back from Aldi's, and I've got one of these to try. It looks like a pretty good find. Yes, that is the boys. Um, I won't be having none of those, but this is what I got for me and Robert to try. It's a, I have panino tray. Anyways, we're going to try these out. I'm fixing to have a couple of these out of here. The rest, I'll probably send some of these with him, not all of them, but... Um, I got the truffle cheese. I got some last time, but I want to try the goat cheese in this. So I'm probably going to try a couple of those. I'll do a picture and insert in. But I've always wanted to try the mozzarella balls. So I got these. Um, let's see how many carbs is in them. I didn't really even look at that. Two carbs for one ounce. And there's eight servings in here. So I'm going to try a couple of these. A little bit of the goat cheese. Let's see. I, don't, I didn't... It has one carb in this, and then I'm going to try some of these. Let's see what the carbs are in these. Less than one. So that ain't bad at all. All right, it's going to be a kind of a cheese meat tray. I might add some honey ham on there, and I'll put a picture in. Okay, so this is my plate. I just did some, about three, three slices or so of the honey ham. I did one each of the... The little snackable things that I found. I did a little bit of the goat cheese and one of the mozzarella balls. This is going to be my snack. I may not do the two meals today just because I had the chicken thing so earlier on today when we were out and about, but it is Friday and I usually do more and we have a ball game to go to. So let's get a picture of this and have my midday snack and it is or lunch. I guess you could say it's 2.09. Okay guys, so I got this at Aldi's. It wasn't but 19, so we're going to see what they look like. Got the, what do you say, 15, 10, and 5. Very, very heavy. I don't know if y'all can see me or not, but. All right, so the first one to pull out is five. And then the next one to pull out is 10. Oh my gosh, yes, they're heavy. And then the next one to pull out 15. Well, they definitely got some weight to it. It's got a disc in there and a chart. Let's see what the chart looks like. I figured for $19 it couldn't be that bad. Well, let's see. It's got a disc. Kettle bell set set fitness. May have like exercise on there. There's just information on them, but here's the chart. I don't know. I can see if I can get up there and focus it in. Let's see. If it ain't dark. No, it's not too bad. That is the chart. Now if I can just put them to use. <laughs> Try me something sweet. So I'm doing one fourth of a cup of raspberries. And then I'm gonna do the same thing with the blueberries. And they're the frozen, uh, the frozen fruit. And then I'm gonna do a tablespoon of sweetener. And then I'm fixing to put in a couple tablespoons of this, and then I'm gonna put in one fourth cup of this, and I'm gonna blend it up. And if it's still thick, I'm gonna add a little bit, bit more of this because I'm gonna make it more like a shake than a ice cream. Okay, so this is the consistency it turned out. It is more like ice cream. I'm just gonna leave it like that because it tastes really good. I ended up doing two tablespoons of this, one fourth a cup of this, and then one fourth of a cup of the berries, and a tablespoon of the sweetener. Frozen treat.